Hello everyone, Aster Brown here, coming 101. Uh, I'm going to do another review, of course. Um, this one is going to be another TMNT uh, series. And, um, before I, I guess I guess, before I can say more, um, in a way I kind of was kind of late to buy the Don Tello and the Leonardo version, because by the time I got my money, it was already gone. So I'm going to do the one I have so far right now, which I keep looking for them out there. So um, if you're looking for a good place, of course you hear me do this all the time. I will put more um, links of other people out there of those stores I go to. But um, yeah, so here's a first place. And then they're the same company, same people, Fighter Corners. The first store is up top, the second store is on bottom, they just open that up. Uh, Facebook.com and of course their uh, phone number. Feel free to pause it just if you know I'm going too fast so you can write this down. All right. Alien Hunters Raphael. As you see, Team and T Cold Green entered the cho choice to win a turtle. Well, really? Oops. Super sick stuff on here, which I did not do. That's what happens when you'll pay attention. As you can see, Raphael looks like he has a like, shredder size or blade on there. He has an e more of a grin on his face. Finally, the TMNT um, crew actually made a different face because he keeps doing the same old toy, just adding more accessories to it. But this one actually, for once, have a better face, different look to it, too. As you can see, they switched the uh, characters around his front. And on the back, this looks like April O'Neil. I think it's supposed to be like a collector card or something. So I got that. On the back, it's you know, of course, going to tell you the history, blah blah blah, how they became turtles. And here's what they look like. I wish I could find him, and I need to find my Leonardo. And of course, here are the monsters. Oh, you get to show them. They're actually on here. Buzz Rock. And let's see, was it this one? It was actually, yeah, it was these two right here. Actually, or supposedly, um, only been, been released in the London, UK. Only in there. But I did see these two in uh, Walmart here in America. After that, I regret not buying them. And oh my god, what were they thinking? But they are one of the most rarest characters, or monsters, I should say. Collect all the alien hunters' fears. No, for kids. As you may see, that doesn't talk too much about you know, the collector card in the back of April O'Neil. Actually, it's still pretty nice back there. I don't know if you guys can see that. Uh, yeah, it doesn't say anything about the collector cards. On the back right here, 2007. So we got a ref right here. So the box is actually different too, as you can see the difference. Alrighty, here's a Michelangelo version. Uh, Alien Hunter Michelangelo, of course. As you can see, they flip flop these like that. I like Michelangelo's suit too because it's like the metallic look to it. And of course, they actually made Michelangelo look like a natural Michelangelo, so they all cracked out of his skull. And his weapons in the back. The collector car is Splinter. As you can see, I really do like the metallic look to it. Of course, after a soup stick, which I never did because I didn't know about that. It's just about the toy. And of course, here's my glass helmet and it's cool looking nunchucks. As you can see, I wish I sh they shouldn't make my gun look like that. So it's all like bugged out of a skull. Of course, the history. Whoosh, bam, boom, turtles. Okay. And as you can see, they had a lot of different helmets, different armors. One of the sends out the one, I don't know, to me, like Raphael and Michelangelo, which I got them. And of course, you got these ones back here. Which doesn't make sense. If these were only released in the UK, how come they're showing on the America box? Then, you know, it doesn't make any sense. And of course, this would be 2007, Playmates Toys. So, uh, tell you guys what you think about these two. I mean, these 
I just both think are really cool. Do you think they're kind of retarded looking? Do you not like their face? I think the Michelangelo face looks so much better than the original. They have more of a mean grin on their face. And wait a minute. Wait a minute. Look at my, my I'm going to check something real quick. Michelangelo face. And then Raphael face. Oops. Wait a minute. Is it just me or do they have the exact same face? No way. Do they? I might be just tripping here. No. Rafael has more of a meaner face. I'm just going to back. Maybe they all look the same. No. Wait a minute. Okay, I'm really tripping out here. Do this. All right. So here's Raphael's face. Looks like that. Eh, maybe not. Cause he looks like he has more of a cigarette in this one than this one. Nah. I don't know. It looks the same to me. Wait, it could be wrong. Yeah, it's still the same. Um. All right. I don't know. I thought maybe something was different. Like I didn't notice. Maybe they have the exact same feature face. I'm looking at it right now. I mean, like, maybe they just kept the same face and they painted a face over it, or no? But no, they're totally different. Okay, I can see a difference now. Yeah, Rafi has more of a side grin. My glance will have more of a front grin. Okay, I'm just making sure. I want to make sure everything's, you know, nothing's all weird and strange. But, um, okay. So that's my review. Got me, like I said, I just want to make sure nothing seems different. So put your comments down. Tell me what you guys think about this. I mean, do you think these are kind of retarded? Do you like them a lot? Do you like Michelangelo, Michelangelo like this? I mean, tell me what you guys think about it. Seriously. Um, I know I've been going through a little crazy. I'm not done. I got so many uh, reviews to do. I had to, I, so there was actually one I had to do redo because I actually uh, trashed it by accident. But, um, yeah. So until uh, next time, people. Add these to your collection, people. Seriously, these things are really cool. And uh, take care of yourself, and happy hunting, everybody. See you later.